What's up guys, welcome to today's video. It's been a while since I've uploaded, but hopefully soon I'll be uploading a lot of videos and I've got a lot to talk about. First thing here I thought was most important is the Superwall 2023 Supers. Most of you already knew I had the nine and these are the six I'm missing and I'm gonna be updating it today. So there's a A case, B case, C case, D, E, F, G, H and J. So here we go. First super I am updating is going to be the Shelby. I was at a Fry's when they dropped the L case exclusive mix, but the shipper was a bunch of F case, K case, and 2022 Q case. And this was back in October. That's how long ago this was. I ended up finding one Shelby right up front, two Renaults, one in the shipper. They also had two little dump-ins. I found a Camaro and a Renault, an 81 Camaro and a Renault in one dump-in, and in the other I found a different 81 Camaro. So I was super excited to get this one so I didn't have it. I already traded away both of those and both Camaros. All right, next super I will be updating is... The Mercury Comet Cyclone. This was a super I really wanted to get my hands on. And thankfully, I was able to with the trade with the Renault. Very nice looking super. It's kind of hard to miss the logo since it's right there showing. And then there's the TH. Very nice color. Ah, there we go. Next super I will be updating is the Mighty K. Another super I was really happy to get. This one I did not find. I paid $40 for it, but I thought that was a good deal. I actually got a discount because I got it at a collectible store and I had a gift card. So I got a discount on it. So it wasn't $40. Nice super. For it being a fantasy car, I mean, well, it's not really a fantasy I mean, it is, but it's not. That's a fantasy car. But this one's really cool. Really like it. Glad I got it. Next super I will be updating is the Porsche 935. Another super I was really happy to get. Got it at the same store, but different days. And... Looking at the Super compared to the mainline, it is really hard to tell the difference. Let me grab the main. You can definitely tell a difference in the paint. This one's metal flake. This one is not. Let me get in the light a bit. Yeah. Very hard to tell the difference. I mean, to me, ever, ever since I've seen this leaked, I always just looked at the rims. It's pretty easy to tell by the rims. All right, let's throw that up there. It's coming together real nice. 13 out of 15. Next super I will be updating is the Volvo wagon. Uh, I think a lot of people think that this super is a little disappointing from what I've seen, but I think it's a really cool super. I also like how slams with the you got the dogs in the back and the license plate says slammed. And on the super, super TH with still the dogs. Really nice. Oh, dang it. All right, there we go. 14 out of 15. Now with the dots in. This little Datsun. For the longest time. I've I've had most of the, I've had pretty much all of these since Q case dropped. And the Datsun is the hard one to get. However, I was with a friend and we went to a bunch of Walmarts. One of the Walmarts put out two dump bins. 
And I think in total there was 18 cases because there was 18 Rams and 18 Datsun wagons. Two of them were Supers. Now, I was freaking out because the first one, because we went there, the dump-ins were not there the previous day. We were there the previous day. And they did not have those bins. So we knew that they were fresh, but we were there two hours after they opened. So we didn't know someone already went through it or not. We pulled up and right on top, right on top of the bin, sitting like this, I seen the pink and I was ecstatic. My friend actually found one of these at Walgreens out of all places. One of two cars on the pegs, he said. So then I was excited that we found this one. Then digging through the bin. So that one was in the middle. And then on the leftmost one, he found another one. Found this one. And then sadly, we went through the rest of the bins. All main lines, but I am happy to even find to have found one. I ended up trading him for this super. Since he said, since we found two, we each took one. He said he would trade a Renault and the Mercedes, both of those for one. And I took him on that since I had extras of that and that. And now I have two. This one I don't plan on trading. I plan on just keeping it. I know it may seem greedy, but I just want to keep it just to keep it. Unless someone offers me something really crazy. Which I doubt it. And there we go. Completed 2023 Supers. Now preferably if I could get these on US cards, that would be good since most since all the rest of them are US carded. But I found this one in store. And this one my friend gave me for a really good price, so I'm not going to complain about those. Well, yeah, so there's this video, and I actually recently just found Neon Speeders. The same day that we found the Dots and Wagons, I found the whole Neon Speeders set, Wave 2. I'll probably do a video on that, but in the meantime, see you guys in my next video.